I know I've said this before, but once again today is the last day of the 52nd Parliament. Uh, we're going to have a short sitting today uh, and the Parliament will be dissolved on Sunday. Uh, so we'll start off with questions. Uh, Judith Collins to the Prime Minister. Uh, does she stand by her statement about being a source of the truth? Uh, Marabha Davids, Davidson to the Minister for Social Development about the winter energy payment. Judith Collins to the Minister of Finance uh, about the package of stimulatory initiatives. Shane Rehe to the Minister of Health about whether he stands by his statements and actions around coronavirus. Uh, Greg O'Connor to the Minister of Finance um, uh, what recent reports has he seen on the New Zealand economy. Uh, Shane Retty to the Minister of Health uh, about border testing. Uh, Paul Goldsmith to the Minister of Finance uh, about decision-making processes uh, for funds allocated from the COVID fund. Uh, Megan Woods to the Minister responsible for the Earthquake Commission uh, about recent announcements on government policy. Nicola Willis, Willis to the Associate Minister of Finance uh, about the Green School and Mika Whaiteri to the Minister of Employment uh, about assisting the rangatahi into employment or training. Uh, after that we will have uh, the general debate. Um, it will be uh, 12 five minute speeches and today it will be led uh, by a five minute speech uh, from an opposition member. After that uh, the House will adjourn theoretically uh, until uh, for two weeks, but actually it will be dissolved before it sits again. I hope to see you for the 53rd Parliament.